Hey guys, so thanks for watching this video. Uh, recently me and my wife decided that we wanted to try the high speed train down in South Florida. So we hopped on a plane for the day from Houston, went down to Fort Lauderdale, rode the train, and then flew back from Miami back home. And it was a pretty good experience. Enjoy the video. All right, good morning. So uh, just arrived at the airport in Houston, getting ready to fly down to Fort Lauderdale, uh, and then ride the Brightline train, and I'm gonna fly back to Houston this evening from Miami. On the train, heading to Terminal E. Right now, I was in Terminal B. Okay, here I am at the gate, right over there. E15, on our way to Fort Lauderdale. So here is the check-in or where to purchase your tickets at the Brightline, well now soon to be Virgin Trains USA. Okay, I'm here at the Brightline station in Fort Lauderdale, getting ready to head down to Miami and uh, eat lunch and then take the Metro Rail over to the airport to fly back to Houston. So far, this Brightline facility is very wheelchair accessible, very easy. The staff were very nice and helpful. And as you can see, the waiting area is, is nice. I think the only thing that's irritating so far uh, in terms of transportation, mobility, locomotion, is the Fort Lauderdale Airport itself getting out of there. So Uber Wave is not here yet, it doesn't look like. So there is no wheelchair accessible vehicles here and the taxis are they're pretty rude and there were no wheelchair accessible vehicles and after being denied by minivans and SUVs we finally begged one to let us get in it because I can get into an SUV and my wife can put the wheelchair in the back but it was not nice he was kind of rude I just can't understand why they don't want business we had a serious communication problem also because none of them spoke English hardly. When we got here, I pulled out my credit card to pay him, and all he would say is, give it to the lady in the back. I'm like, why? Why don't you take it? Comes to find out, on the back of the seat is his card, credit card machine. And so, I didn't know that because I was in the front seat and I couldn't see that. He just kind of expected that I saw that. Super excited. A train is coming. Welcome to Brightline. Please take a moment to familiarize yourself with the information booklet in your seatback pocket. Inside, you'll find safety and emergency exit Thank information, you. as well as a list of onboard amenities. Snacks and beverages will be served and are available for purchase for guests in our smart coach and complimentary for those riding in select. Thank you and enjoy the ride. So, we're on the train. So, here we are on the train. It's pretty quiet and it's pretty smooth. Currently, it's running only between West Palm Beach, Fort Lauderdale, and Miami. Operator intends to open a line or extend this line up to Orlando by 2021 or 22, I believe. Thank you. So 
So after we rode the Bright Line train to Miami, we got off and had lunch at a really cool restaurant there called Joe something. I forgot the name already. I'm sorry. Anyway, from there, we got on the Miami's Metro Rail train, took that to the airport. From there, we had to get in on a different train to take it from the airport's train station to the actual airport itself. So a lot of trains today, from the airport in Houston to the Brightline train to the Miami Metro Rail train to the airport connector train. Okay, everybody. Uh, I really appreciate you appreciate you watching this. Uh, if you liked if you liked it, please give a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it two thumbs down. Uh, I'm going to put a link here to the American American Rail Club. If you have any more questions about high speed rail in the country, uh, this uh, group out of South Florida can probably either has a video or can answer your questions. I'm going to put a link in the description down below. And have a good day and enjoy this blooper. Okay, so now we're at the gate E15. And you get over there. Service because of your wife. Judy, I'm trying to record. I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. The, the extras were getting, talking too much. You don't have a script, so be quiet. <laughs> 